I feel like I'm having, I feel like I'm having deja vu because we just finished our workout and this is the first thing that I see. It's day 15! How you doing there, husband? Good. How was your workout? Long. <laughs> Long? You feel like you're losing any? Oh, yeah. So what do you do, Jazono, to stay in on track with your diet when you're at work? I keep away my friends from me. <laughs> yes, they were very bad influence. I feel lonely. You feel lonely? Yes. At Everybody work? eats but me. Aww. Aww. They all I'm go to the cafe. Too. I'm in that way too. How's your workout doing? Hard. I sweat a lot. It's day 15. Day 15. That's good though. Which sometimes yeah. I feel like when we go out, it's hard for me to get excited about going out because it's like I don't want to get excited about picking out food. <laughs> because it's like, well, I can't have this. I like salad, I guess. But mm -hmm. we're trying to find some new and fresh cafes. So. If you're going to go out, yeah. if you have to go out, then, you know, whatever. But with me last night, I did really hard workout. I did um, level one while I was waiting for them to get everybody to get here. Um, but I did level one because I needed to work out. I felt like I had a lot of energy that needed to go. Plus, I knew we were going out to dinner. So I was like, let me just do level one again. And then I'll do day 14. That was yesterday. That's why we didn't make a video. My mom was here and we were working out and then getting showered and then running straight to uh, dinner and to go see a movie. We went to go see Evil Dead, which was kind of like a really, really weird movie. <laughs> Very weird. Don't mess with that stuff. Don't mess with that stuff. <laughs> Don't mess with the witchcraft. Don't mess with the devil. Don't mess with none of that stuff. Imaginary friends. Don't mess with that stuff. Leave that shit out of my house. That's what I always say. Um, but anyway, so day 14, we really didn't get to make a video because my mom was here and nobody wants to see her on camera. Trust me, she's a riot. Oh my god. <laughs> She'd be hilarious. But uh, I knew we were going out to eat, so we picked Thai Thai, which is like a, um, it's a nice Thai restaurant. And I had some Tom Yum Guy, which was really, really good. Bad service. <laughs> he doesn't like the service there. The it service is. is pretty crappy there, I have to it admit. Is. I know, but it's my favorite place. So anyway, uh, we went to eat, and it's really hard to go pick out stuff that you're going to eat. But if they have a salad, and you stick to the salad instead of the dressing, because a lot of places, hey, I work in a restaurant, and I know where they get you with the calories, it's the salad dressing. Condiments. So Condiments. Mm -hmm. So... Um, ask for oil and vinegar and just use the vinegar or just a little bit of oil because the vinegar has way 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 less calories than the oil anyway and if they use extra virgin olive oil it's like 150 calories for like two tablespoons or a tablespoon or something like that so don't waste it if you need something on your salad because you just can't have it have nothing on it and you don't like oil or vinegar try lemon um, ask for lemons and just squeeze those on there or, or, bring your own or any kind of thing or bring your own dressing a lot of places are okay with that be like psh, psh, save your calories I got my hidden valley in my purse or whatever you feel like bringing with you whatever but anyway when you go out to eat it's really really hard what do you do when you go out to eat what do you order do you find it hard to be social in my family we go out to eat a lot because my mom comes up from out of town, and I mean, my dinner table is not exactly the greatest, so I don't even think we have three chairs. We've got two chairs and a fold-up chair. Like, we just don't have the room for everybody, so we usually go out and find something to eat. And uh, places like Applebee's have a have a fit fair kind of mm -hmm. fit uh, Weight meals, Watcher. Weight Watcher meals or whatever diet you're, you're following. Um, but yeah, make sure you update all of your stuff on my fitness pal. I know we are. Um, I use that religiously everywhere I go. And uh, yeah, we are halfway through. We're almost done with the shed. 
what level are you on and what day are you on. It's hard for you. Tell us what you're doing. Tell us what you're doing. Yeah. Oh, take a look at my fruit thing before you go. I got a little excited. And I went and got some fruit. I went a little overboard. But I got a nice little organic seedless watermelon and no GMOs and some cantaloupe and some bananas. There's apples. They're like the tiniest little apples. My husband will eat them or I'll give them to Conejo, our rabbit. Um, grapefruit, some, what are these called again? Uh, they're like peaches but without the fur. Um, and then limes and Oh, it's all good stuff. Bananas, everything is good for you. But yeah, I went a little overboard with the fruit. So, um, because that's the only way I've been eating carbs. I try to stay away from carbs if at all possible. And if I get them, I get them in fruits and vegetables. Alrighty, Erin. You got anything else? No. Day 15. Halfway there. We're going to have another video for you coming soon. Peace and love. Peace out. <laughs> Don't go see Evil Dead.